Is it live? Can you see me? Can you actually see me? Or we are not recording because we have a technical issue. Hello! Hi! I'm Toy. I'm Goy. And welcome to another episode for the Road to Tel Aviv 2019! Oh, I'm, I'm, getting, I'm getting better. Yeah. Now, now I need to walk on my accent. Yeah. Walk on my British accent. Oi, mate! Oh, mate! Oh, the Road to Tel Aviv, mate! <laughs> 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 Is it good enough? Yes, as Greece. Yes, as Europe. Greece starting now. Did we dance enough? Well, we I have to... a cold. Yes, you have a cold. Yes. I understand that. I can't believe that you got a cold in the most stressful week. Oh, why am I speaking? Oh God, that's disgusting. <laughs> <laughs> In the most busiest week in your revision election process, you got in. This is the closest to sympathy I've ever got from him. <laughs> I'm sorry. Oh, you're touching me. Normally it's, oh, you're ill. Don't come near me. Don't come near me. I Can I have a wash. kiss? I need to wash my hands. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> let me tell you about Greece. Greece has a population of 10.8 million. 60% of those people live in Athens. We have a, a lovely close friend who is from Greece. Voting is not a choice. It is the law. Every citizen must vote. You know what happens if they don't? It's a law everywhere. Just people don't you vote. You don't have to. You have to. You don't have to. Think you do not have to vote in the UK. In Greece, you have to vote. That's but what I found out. You have to vote. By law, you have to vote. Whether if you Well, didn't. all of the facts I've searched for, for every single country, that has not come up before. So I'm guessing... That's not the case. And what you're saying is actually wrong. These are my facts. I don't want to upset you, especially when you're ill. I might sneeze on you. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and what I was going to talk about was how interesting that would have been in the UK if we'd had that when the Brexit referendum happened. Don't be upset with me today. Oh, I don't question your Eurovision facts. Do well, I? you do sometimes. When? Off camera. When? <laughs> Taken all the fun out of this now. The word barbarian comes from the Greek word barbaroi, meaning people who don't speak Greek. Now I like that a lot. That's extremely passive aggressive. <laughs> the way that the word has now been warrior, but who's a bit brutal, he doesn't really have honor. And so they were it came from the word for barbaroi, someone who doesn't speak Greek, which was ba 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 ba. <laughs> Greece has the lowest divorce rates in the EU, but also the highest abortion rates. Very, very contrasting things there. Is that related to each other, you think? They stay with a the partner they're not happy with, get pregnant, oh, not again. But we have to do an abortion. <laughs> no, it's... Lot, this is my last one. You'll be pleased to hear, because... Yeah, I wonder when, what time we will get to the video, to the music clip. <laughs> What's the last one? Greeks have, on average, sex 165... <laughs> on average, Greeks have sex 164 times a year, making them the most sexually active country in the world. 164 times. Do we have sex 164 times a year? Even if we do, it's not the right time to be sexy. <laughs> Thank you very much for... Disputed facts today. Jesus. It was hard work with you today. May I, I, I forgive you. It so Greece joined Eurovision in 1974. Uh, Did they? Are you sure that's right? Do we need to check? <laughs> Listen to that fact. They were in the finals, 12 out of 14. One of the... Mm -hmm. uh, was that a shock last year? Last year. Last year, <clears throat> they sent a very, very... Uh, they sent a very, very song. authentic song, studio version, brilliant, beautiful. Well, when we saw it live, it was fantastic. Uh, they, 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 Greece has done better live performances in the past. So, and this song could have been so magical and something in the staging, in my opinion, was off, but it doesn't change the fact that I love this song. It was really, really uh, good. And they won, they won one time. I see it. With Elena Paparizzo, mm -hmm. uh, my number one, 2005. You are my number one. <clears throat> this year, they sending uh, Catherine Duska. So, Elena Paparizzo won with my number one. Yes. This song calls Better Love. So <laughs> she's, she's looking for a better love. <laughs> but Better Love, it's important to say that everything we are saying here is our own honest opinion and we are not here to offend, insult, objectifying or hurt your feelings or your country. Sorry. And if we do, we are. <laughs> Catherine Duska, Better Love, Eurovision 2019, Greece, starting now. No pain, no gain 
pain Teach me carelessness And I'm about to see all that's made of and everything This is a studio version, we forgot to say Because there isn't a live yet She has an extremely nasally voice Nasally? Mm. From the like it's coming from the nose I'm not Usually I go, oh, so I'm trying to be open-minded. It's open just the minded. first 20 seconds of the song. Yes, when and it, it put it? me off, I'm afraid. But let's, let's continue. The video looks fun. So let's enjoy it. <laughs> no pain, no gain. One spinning, make way and I can hide it. I want your need feeling inside. It's annoying me a bit because it's hard for me to judge this song because it's a clip and clip yeah. always sounds much better, looks much better and so, edited much better. <clears throat> and ignore I, the clip. I'm trying to listen only to the sound. I'm getting an enormous Jess Glynn vibe. She released some songs with Clean Bandit, got really famous and then released her own album. And she, this, the arrangement of this and the sound of this is reminding me of Jess Glynn. I'm, I'm, I'm not I, I, loving this. I'm not hating it. For some reason, it gave me a bit of vibe of Amy Winehouse. Oh, okay. But it's her voice is not as deep as Amy Winehouse, mm -hmm. but <clears throat> it gave me that. There's nothing more to say to back it up when I'm unafraid. I've lost enough. Go on, hold on, but... Cause I I like it. I can't stop thinking about Neta's dress in the clip from last year. <laughs> you remember the, the big white uh, thing? Oh, the, not in Basa Sababa then, the pink. Oh, so maybe that's why for some... Yes, there is the Basa Sababa... Mm. Clip, but there is the clip in toy where she wore the white. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Thing you went, yeah. Yeah. I feel like the chorus doesn't go as far as I want it to. It doesn't reach this plateau that I want it to reach. It kind of. It's a very nice song. It I'm is. sure it will do well. Yeah. Well, let's let's finish it. A bit too clunky. Like it's the chorus isn't flowing through the melody. It's very stop start stop start. Have you seen the season uh, with American Horror Story when it was the freak show? No. <laughs> <laughs> the last image of them all standing like that. That's <laughs> sorry. I'm sorry. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Great. It's very nice. It's not for me. I, I'm just... Yeah, you would just straight to the I point. didn't like her voice. Didn't like the chorus. It didn't fill me with happiness. The arrangement was a very upbeat, happy, current kind of pop song, but it wasn't making me feel that. It didn't make me emotional in any way. <clears throat> no, it's funny that you said that. I think when we watch songs for the first time, there is an imaginary screen, well, the screen of the computer, but there is an imaginary screen where the song can break this screen and get into us yeah. and hit us. Um, some of the song straight away mm -hmm. hit us somewhere in our body, and some of the songs stay there. And, yeah. and this song tried, it really tried, but it was stopped. Yeah. The thing is, I do like the fact that we have this kind of song in Eurovision because that sits on this woman soul spot. Yeah that yeah. we don't have yet this year. I think they will qualify, but besides that, I can't say I enjoyed it. Clip is fascinating, 
in a way where what's going on there, but it's not fascinating yet. What I want to, to watch say it again. What I want to say, and it's unfair, is that because we just did Cyprus and that was also an official clip, I have to compare the two because they're the only two female singers we've seen with the clip. And the Cyprus clip was extremely interesting. This was like, oh, here's a cool idea, but we're not really gonna follow through with it with enough to make it really, really fun. But that's besides the point, that's nothing to do with yeah. Eurovision. And I think this um, song will be it will grow on us. I think it might song, be grown. I, I think with this song as more as we hear it, we will like it, but that's the problem. We are not looking for a song that will grow on us to win the Eurovision. We are looking at the song that on the night will just bring so much joy to so yeah. many people that they will evoke. I don't think this is Greece yet, but we Who never knows? know. Yeah. We never know. This is this is only my opinion. What do I know about Eurovision? <laughs> Please let us know in the comments below what you thought about the Greece entry, Greek entry for 2019, Moldova or Greece? Stick with Moldova. Are you <coughs> taking Catherine Duska over Kate? So, Kate, we need to talk because we are spending so much time and you haven't called me for a while. I'm kidding. Of course I'm staying. Well, of course I'm staking. <laughs> Kate, it's, it's, she, she's lovely and I can't wait to see what she will come up with in, in Tel Aviv. And, but there are many songs to go yet. So, who knows? That what's winner could be hiding just around the corner for you. It could be the last song. <gasps> oh, knowing it would be for Kate. <laughs> <laughs> she's, she's there at the altar, waiting. Oh no, you'd be at the altar, wouldn't you? <laughs> let's, let's, she'd be there at the church, ready to marry you. She walks in with her dad on her arm, the doors open, and you've gone. Because And you know what she will say to me? Stop! <laughs> Call your mama! <laughs> Run! <laughs> Please let us know in the comments below what you thought about the Greek entry. If you like this video, thumbs up. Please consider subscribing to our channel if you haven't done so. Follow us on Facebook, Instagram, send us a message. Check our new uh, shop threads. Maybe you want to buy Toy and Go sweet, merch? Sweet merch. And see you guys very, very soon.